Dr. Seema, is it safe for women to venture out of the house or chop vegetables during a complete solar or a lunar eclipse? A lot of people actually advise against this. Well, during a lunar eclipse or solar eclipse, medically nothing happens which actually should pose any restrictions on a pregnant woman. And I often sometimes, you know, always try and find a reason why this whole folklore started. And to me, it appears that, you know, probably many years, maybe 100 years down the line, you know, when we did not have electricity and, you know, we were relying, relying on solar light or lunar light for visibility. And during the times of these eclipses, you know, we did not even have that much light. So people advise that, you know, you don't chop vegetables because there is a danger that if you can't see, you might chop your finger instead. And you don't eat anything because there could be insects in your food. You know, you're not seeing what you're eating. So probably during those times, you know, it all started that during complete lunar eclipse or solar eclipse, don't have, don't venture out because you might fall, you might hurt yourself and don't chop vegetables again. You know, you could injure yourself and, you know, don't eat because you can't see your food. But when, you know, today we have everything available, all electricity, everything is there and really, you know, you're not venturing out also in darkness. Uh, I don't think this advice really uh, holds good. And medically, it has been proved scientifically that there is absolutely nothing harmful coming out during those eclipses which could harm your fetus or yourself. So feel free, don't restrict yourself during eclipses. It's just any other normal day. It's just going to happen 12 times in a year anyway. Lunar eclipse would happen. So, you know, you really, um, you know, can't be restricting yourself so much. It's just like any other day.